If somebody's looking to build an energy efficient house, I think first of all start with the design. Orientation, big windows on the south side, that kind of thing is really important. And try and invest in the structure most of all. So insulation, if you can possibly afford it, triple glazing, particularly on the north side of things, is really key. And then the renewables and all the kind of the big bling, as we call it, that comes later on during the day. So but if you can minimise the amount of energy you need, first of all, then actually the minimal extra investment in insulation in particular is well worth it. If you wanted to get started on building a passive house, I think the first thing to do is identify a designer who's got really good pedigree in the field. I think actually the idea of adding a bolt-on passive house package to any old house design is really a big mistake and a bad place to start. I think you need to get it right, go to an experienced house designer who's got experience in not just necessarily designing passive houses but understanding the insulation levels and the specification that you need as well. So go to an expert first of all, it's really a very niche element of self-build and just sort of go to a random self-built designer and try and get a passive house from them is always a mistake. The big do of a passive house, the really important thing to get right, is actually to really follow it all the way through. A lot of people end up sort of aspiring to a passive house and then falling just a bit short at the end when it comes to spending an extra bit more money on, on an extra bit of insulation or air tightness or whatever. But actually, it's such an exacting process, this passive house planning package, that would-be self-builders who are doing these passive houses go through, that actually to sort of stop and fall off just short on the end can really risk things like overheating actually uh, and, and sort of big problems around kind of the insulation not really working well. So you've got to do it properly if you're going to do it at all. That's the big, big tip I would give to people.